That's too loud. This is amazing. I think I can honestly say that on behalf of the Parkland School District, I'd like to welcome you to what looks to be like the finale for American Idol, <laughs> where everyone is a winner. My name is Debbie Miller. I'm the director of curriculum here at Parkland, and it, is, it pleases me to be able to welcome you to this quite auspicious event. In front of you, you see 250 fourth, fifth, and sixth grade students who met for the first time today. This is the first time they're all together to take their songs and blend it as one. And I can assure you that you will have goosebumps, butterflies, and be overwhelmed with the talent that you're going to see this evening. It's important to understand a couple of things, and I say this on behalf of the parents, being a parent myself, but I also want the students to hear what I have to say. The United States Department of Education did a study in 2005, and they followed 25,000 students in grades 8 through 12, and they followed the students who participated in the arts. And what they discovered was that these students were four times more likely to achieve high academic levels, specifically in the areas of math and science. These students also were the students that were elected to leadership levels, whether they were class officers or rose to levels in extracurricular activities. They also were able to talk about the students who developed tolerance, confidence, and self-esteem. These students are on the right path, and they've already made a commitment to practice, rehearse, and follow the direction of their leaders. I would like to be able to acknowledge just a couple of groups of people, because you cannot pull something like this off without a lot of effort and hard work 